Alright everyone, welcome back to my channel for episode 4 of Asuka, single player. We end the last episode when we finally have a warrior to protect our village and was about to set up a patrol route. So let's get back to it. And then... I want her to come over here. And we can get them over there and oh wait hold on you need to a bunch of you need weapons uh, That and that You cannot eat that anymore. That's already off Anyway, uh, you have a weapon. I need to give you a shield which is right there amazing. Where are you come back here come back and come here You is that gun heal? Yes gun heal grab a shield and that's it uh we need another marker, which is here. Okay, I have nothing to... Oh, yes! Let's build the workshop now! Yeah, now, not the workshop paper barracks, we can uh, create a better patrol point. At patrol point. No wait time. Okay, let's put one. At patrol point. Confirm. Save. Is that how that works? How do I know which one is one, which one is two, which one is three? Patrol markup. Okay. Can you rename them? I don't know if you can rename them. Let's go. Show radius. Ah, you can name them. Yes, you can. This will be workshop. Let me go there. This will be the shelter. Rename. Done. So right now, the patrol route is... Barrack to workshop to shelter. Okay, you can train two hours there. Stay one hour, one hour, go back, train two hours and so. Okay, great. I need two-handed weapon to patrol and keep the village safe. Two-handed weapons. Okay. This is two-handed weapons. Okay. What's up? What's your problem? No locks. Okay. How about... Wait, hold on. Let me grab this. How about you go help with... Woodcutter's hut. You go help them. And here I made you a club. <laughs> now is the resting time or what? I don't understand. Okay. Um, now... Just have a look at the entire village. What's the situation? We got a bunch of uh, garlic, carrot, and mushroom to cook, which is great. Let me grab some uh, firewood. Okay, now I have cooked. Quite a bit of food for them. There's still a bunch of mushroom in the foraging hut that I can cook. Maybe during the night so I don't go wander around by myself. Look at the guy or girl. <laughs> Patrolling the place. Wait, now we can have a look at how they actually feel with the patrolling. You see, slightly increasing, moderate, moderately increasing. Well, because of the daylight devotion, obviously. So, oh my god, because he's working, because she's working the job that she likes, she is very happy. So this is how important it is to put them on to the job that they like. Ah, I also real forgot about one thing. What time is it now? Six. Actually, you know what? I should put her to sleep now. Because everyone is going to sleep at... 7, no, 21, so her schedule actually have to be, let's go to bed now, oh my god, um, because everyone goes to bed at 23, 
So work 23 until 7, I believe. That's the time that uh, they wake up. Wake up. 5. She will have 1 hour leisure time. And then here, a bit of leisure time. How is the... F yes. Uh, is she okay now? As in... Yeah, she needs to sleep for a bit. So that's uh, almost 8 o'clock. And what time is she... 8 o'clock 20. She has one hour to sleep. Give her one more hour to sleep. And then leisure time 23. And then work from there. Okay, good. Because the because of the job, she's happy about being warrior. That helped a lot about her happiness. Thank thanks to that. Is she sleeping now? Yes. Yes. So get some rest. Let's see how is uh, her resting. Yeah, her resting meter is coming back up. Eight o'clock. Yes, it's gonna be fine. Luckily. Warriors feels honored to defend their village. Amazing. Man, she becomes the. Hero of the village. <laughs> and also, because of that, everyone can sleep uh, without feeling unsafe. Oh my god, I forgot about the... Uh... Mushrooms. <laughs> it's okay, better that way. And then uh, I will cook the mushroom at night. Let's turn the fire off. I'm pretty sure there's a... Oh my god, these people eat a lot. Alright, alright, alright. Let's cook, cook one more round and that's it. So once that workshop upgraded, we're going to build the cottage and then destroy all of this so we can put something better, let's say. Maybe another cottage just right here. Turn this platform into a cottage platform. We'll see how big the cottage is and then we can call for more villager. What do we need for this thing to be built? Alright, uh, what is everyone's doing now? Okay, they're all chilling over there. Why is Ziggy go to sleep so early? Earlier than everyone else. So if I put him work one more hour, would he be upset? Let's see. No, he was alright? Okay, cool. <laughs> Let's test one more hour then. One more hour, one more hour. Are you okay with that? Hey, still okay. Alright. What about you? So if I put... One more hour. One more hour. Apply. You happy? Yes. Okay, now suddenly they are happy. There. There. No, four hours of sleep. That's too harsh. Let's go there. You okay with that? Yes. Yes. Yeah, Gunhill, we will play around with the schedule because obviously she's a warrior. She needs to be awake at night to protect the village. How are you feeling now? You good? Okay, that means we can put you to work more. Is that okay? Yep, yep. Oh, he's okay. One more. Still okay. One more. Okay, now they are all a lot happier to work a bit more. Okay, now it's, now it's not. <laughs> Don't take a piss. Yeah, now it's okay. And you? Okay, he's not, she's not happy, Anna. Wait, let's see if we can just copy paste this one here. How do you feel? Okay, not, not too okay. I guess she wants to have another leisure time, maybe. From here, what do you think? Yeah, that's better. Okay, these two have leisure time a bit earlier than them. And then, yeah, that kind of balanced out. Okay, this has a lot of leisure time. Can we put him work one more hour? No, he said no. Now he's happy. Okay, okay, if this is what you want, fine. And also, if you notice, now they're sleeping, we don't have 
the debuff of anxiety. That is amazing. Amazing. Everyone seems pretty happy. And uh, have a look at the food situation. Yes, we got pretty... Oh, yeah. I was saying we're going to cook food, right? That's a lot of mushrooms. Okay, we're going to spend the entire night here cooking. Let's go. Alright, let's see. Uh, what well, about from cooking? I can actually do some of this work. <laughs> I'm too impatient to just sit there to uh, watch the mushroom getting cooked. There we go, workshop hut 2 is built. Let me see what we can do here. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff we can do here now. Farming tools, rig tools, you must build farm. Okay, fair enough. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. Large crude iron axe, you must build carpenter. Flimsy fishing tools. Here we can make uh, armor as well. Woof, that opens up. A whole new bunch of stuff. Right, now they are awake. Are they all awake? Yes, they are all awake. So maybe Gunhill can go to sleep now. How's Gunhill feeling? Not too bad at all, actually. So, now we can adjust her schedule properly. Leisure, leisure. Apply. What do you think of that? Schedule balance, work hours minus. Amazing. She's happy. Maybe, maybe even push her a little bit more. <laughs> She's still okay with that. Let's push her one more. Wow, she's willing to work. Oh my gosh, she's only sleeping seven hours. Okay, let's push it one more hour. See if she's gonna complain. Okay, now she's complaining. Don't take a piss. Yeah, now she's happy. There you go. Wow, that's a lot of food there for them. Amazing. Okay, let's go back to uh, the workshop that we just upgraded and see what's going on there. Uh, hopefully we can find a yes a better bow simple bow a simple and reliable bow base damage three to six okay yeah we, we want to get that oh there's another one long bow basic bow meant to be used at long distance five to eight wood shaft what the hell is wood shaft how do I even get that okay let's get the simple bow first at least we know we can get that. We have everything. We just need four more sticks and that's it. Simple bow craft. Uh, the other one, we're just going to throw it on the floor. Bye-bye. I'm going to put Stigert back on here. Because Stigert is the crafter. Yes, he is. Take him out of that. Workshop. Put him in there. Craft some stuff, 10 ropes, large, two, two hammers, wooden hole, just in case I'm going to make another heavy club. There. Alright, uh, forager side is, should be okay, we've got plenty of food. I think it's time, oh my god, even more food now. Alright, let's go. Um, we want to put down a, what's that called again? Cottage, yes. How big is this thing? Uh, can we... If we remove these huts... Yeah, we, I think we can fit one right there. Nicely. Yeah, let's do that. Dismantle. Cottage. Look at this. Come on, turn green. How flat do you need this place to be? Uh, almost, almost. Damn, I don't get it. Ah, screw it. Let's go. This works for me. Actually, this is quite urgent though, because the there's no house there. So I'm gonna get one person off the woodcutter hut. Scar has less. Okay, you come out. You help me. Nice. Okay. Good thing is everything is here. Long sticks, log, four logs. We have three. Wow, 
5.30. Now we have enough time. I think we're going to make it. No, this is only the first stage. <laughs> okay, next. 10 lost. Oh my goodness. I don't know if we're going to make it though. It's a lot of materials. A lot. I think he's already done a great job on crafting stuff. Okay, what do you need now? We need bark for crafting. I'm getting... Okay, now. Go back to your chopping job. We don't need you to craft anything else anymore. Workshop hit. No, I don't think we're going to make it before they go to bed. I don't know how pissed off that person is going to be without a place to sleep. Oh, I can use her bed. Gunhill, yes, dismiss. Assign Laurit. Yes. Perfect. Eleven. That's also one more stage. It's not even the last stage yet. Oh my god. This um cottage takes forever to build. Okay, finally, last one. We are missing three sticks, one long stick, and one rope. That should be easy. Three sticks, one long stick. I don't remember what time Gunhill goes to bed, but we need to hurry. There we go. Our first cottage. There is two beds. Yes, yes, we can straight away assign a... Uh, uh, cottage with... Gunhill, amazing, let's go. And uh, where is this, um, what's it called? This smokes. I can test my bow out. Perfect, come on. I don't see any of them uh, smoker anywhere at all. How's the food situation? Looking good, actually looking good, amazing. How do we craft more bed? Oh yes, we can get more uh, villager now. Let's go, let's go. Um, we have a big axe. Yes, let's go. Let's get some food first. We need uh, Sigi. Goes back to Gatherer's hut. ASAP. No wonder there is no food there. Makes perfect sense. A Jotun stone. Actually, two side by side. Amazing. How many we got? One, two, is that it? Ah, uh, come on, okay. Give me three, boop! Ah, uh, two, that's okay. Alright, still two pieces only, but it's okay, we have enough, let's head back home. Give us some good people, please. Let's go. Stormforge, I've been imbued with the power of spawn and I draw strength from thunderstorm. Okay, that's a positive. Cold resistant, not afraid of storm. I like him already. Shrimpy Woodsman. I am proficient in wood cutting, but I eat more than a normal villager. Okay, craftsman. Mm. I'm curious to see what he knows the rest. But. The only reason that this one puts me off is um, I eat more than normal villager. Let's go for gunner. Confirm gunner. And also, how do I craft more beds actually? Uh, there you go, small fireplace, thatch bed, there, thatch bed. Steak, thatch, easy. So this, basically we can have two more beds here. We can dismantle the Dutch bed, yes. And then... Put it... There. And one more here. There. So when Gunhill wakes up, we're gonna... Move her bed a bit further. Oh! I didn't know we have a builder. Who's the builder? Builder, Sigi. What are you talking about? Sigi is, should be in a gatherer's hut. Oh my goodness. So a barrack, woodcutter, stone, forager. Scott can go... Yeah, Scott can help me build shit. 
three more thatch. Come on, just three more thatch. Easy. <laughs> we have zero. <laughs> Right, that's more than enough to craft those beds. Oh hi, yeah, I'd like to try my new bow actually. Woo! That was amazing. Feeling powerful. Ah, she's moved so we can dismantle her bed. And uh, move it a bit further. Now we need, what did it say? We need a uh, new marker for rocks. So we're gonna put here and here then. There you go. I don't know where I wanna build another cottage. Let's get up to uh, to the Odin Eye and see. Have a look at the view. Right, so that's one. Maybe towards that side I'm not too sure towards that side so we can destroy two so four beds plus two that's six because we are we are gonna have six in 25 seconds Woo. let's get this built and then we go out there to help defend and we can also have fun with our bow gunners are here Okay, let's uh, quickly assign him into the shelter first. Uh, there. And where is these monsters? No, they're up there. Oh, headshot actually will knock them down. Woof! How you doing? Wow, she's almost full health. Amazing. Blood Moon is not finished yet though. Alright guys, it is the end of an episode again. Thank you for watching and as always, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!